Hey, it's Lego Reviewer 360 doing a review of the Lego Mindstorms NXT. Here, let's look. Some extra parts of stuff I have. And then there's a box. So, some stuff you can build extra. It's like crane, a little crawler dude, and a scorpion. Um, just 10 and up, 577 pieces. Get a USB cord. It's Bluetooth compatible and PC and Mac. You can use it more. Um, Box. And then you can open it up. Sorry, the color filter on my camera is kind of screwed, so it's all messed up. The color, except for like the red in some colors, aren't messed up. But there's all some audio pieces you get. There's yeah, the mat, just the big mat right there. Um, the manual, manual, another like instruction type thingy, and then CD. But I already have it installed. It's we get to it's that right there. And those are the ones you get. You get a light sensor, a sound sensor, a touch sensor, ultrasonic sensor, three motors, and the NXT brick. So yeah. Okay. Before I did a video, I I didn't. I'm not actually gonna put it on YouTube because it was so bad. There's my robo, my robo dude. Do me in. Okay. What? Well, there it is. But I'm just going to go walk over somewhere where it's not carpet. So hopefully you walk a little bit better. Okay. Um, I'm just going to set the camera down, sort of. So, um, see if that kind of sees him. Okay. Now, I'm going to go over. I'm gonna run program YouTube. He's going backwards. I the camera. Going backwards. And I don't know why it's going backwards. Um, but he's going backwards. And right now I don't really know how to program him that well. And then he stopped. But I think, I think, I think he. That I have a program where what he does is he walks until he sees something in his way and then backs up and goes away. Like there, see he doesn't want, trying not to go towards me, but I don't know, kind of messed up. And then he's walking forward. Or semi walking for it. That leg seems to just slide and then go back and then it needs to bring it forward more or something. Anyways, but I'm going to switch the program. No, don't do that. Let's try this one. There, you can talk too, by the way. To anybody who didn't. There we go. Now he's walking forward semi like he's supposed to. So, for those who've never seen a Robo Mindstorm guy walk before, here's a chance to see it. Go horizontal. Now go back because you guys are watching a video. Um, he's probably gonna walk into me, probably. Um, yeah, okay. So, there. That was him walking. Um, now I'm going to shake you and so I'm going to show you how to use the program on it. So nobody's asking me to do a video on how to do the programming. Because I don't really know how, but I might as well show people how to. Okay. Okay, so I'm going to show you to program it, sort of. Um... I'm going to show you how to program so I'm just going to click on the program and it's going to pop up and it's going to load It's going to load, and then it's going to come up. Okay, those are the instructions on how to build stuff. Step by step instructions, you can click on that, but that's just going to take too much time. So I'm going first, you want to go here. You want to go start new program. That's what I'm going to do. I'm just going to make a completely new one. I'm going to go to, I'm going to name it YouTube. YouTube 1. Enter. 
Alright. And then this comes. This is where you actually program it from. This whole thing. All those options. So first I'll put a word. I'll put play. I'll put play. Hmm. I'll get him to say something. Cause you can get him to say something like I'll get him to say hello. Hello. And then get him to say that. And then play that. And then I'll get him to walk. There, sorry, I was aiming the camera in the wrong spot. And you'll see right here. So if I want to walk forward all three motors, because if you don't do all three motors, then he's going to go, go lopsided, kind of. And then that's the speed. Can you click on that and I want to go forward all the way. And then I'm going to do it for seconds. So I'm going to go to that. And I'll do it for 10 seconds. Well, it's not there. Nope. Oh my gosh, my computer's being an idiot. Um, 10 seconds. And then I'm going to want to... And I plugged in the USB cord. I'm going to hit. Download. And of course, the color filter is screwed up, so don't give me comments about it, because I know it's screwed up. I'm just going to turn it on. Turn on. Maybe we can see the screen. Maybe sort of see it. Um, and then I'm gonna, and then I'm gonna go to download. And then it's gonna say compiling, downloading, and then when you hear the beep, it's done. Kind of like a microwave. Um, I'm gonna unplug it. I'm going to go to. Oops, I turned it off. Maybe I'll get it to walk on the carpet now because before I tried and it failed. Epic fail. Um, I'm gonna go to files, software files. I'm gonna click on YouTube One. It saves it right to it, so it's got like its own little memory. So it saves it right to it. And I'm gonna hit run it. And this is what it seems to do on carpet. It seems to somewhat do that. I'm not sure why, but that's what it does when it goes on carpet. You have to be on something like the hardwood over there. I'll be on something like that, or it just doesn't want to walk at all, for some reason. And, of course, this is an instruction manual, and uh, you also get, and if you ever do this, build that middle one first. It's the one it says, right, this one, here, I'll show you. This one here. If you build this first, it's going to make your life a lot easier. Of course, put batteries, batteries in it first. And then test all the things, probably you want to do that, and then step-by-step -step instructions, and then it's really easy, kind of, with that, and then you're going to want to put tires on it, and hook all the cables up to it, which it comes with, so you don't have to buy the separate or anything, hook it up, and then program it, obviously, and then it shows you just, that's what you want to do, or you can go to computer, and go to humanoids if you want, to build that robot that I have, go to that, and then I want to just build his feet, because that's what you had. You had to build parts, and that's what his feet look like. I'm going to go to start. But since I can't really see, I'm going to go to zoom, and it's going to pop up full page. This is really cool. You can build a Lego set on your computer with the instructions from your computer, so it's pretty cool. And then just click whenever you're ready. It takes you to the next step. Of course, you go always click really fast. It takes, like, not really the second foot. Take that, that, this feet and this whole robot took me a while. It took about two hours. Um, then keep clicking and then you're done. And yeah, so. Yeah. And I'm not going to save that program. Mm, no, I don't. Okay. Uh, this has been Lego Review 360 with a review of the Lego Mindstorms NXT.